Thanks for tuning in. Day and night. We roll it up to keep our soul alive. She took this money and she did. And I just had to make sure that I dropped some more episodes on y'all. I'm going to be doing these a lot more. These quick episodes. Well, maybe not quick, but give you a little bit by myself. I am an entertainer, drummer, uh, artist, and I tour the country. That's just my art. That's just what I love doing. Go check out the music. The music is called Dirty Harvard. Go check that out. Also, what is Gas Mask Tribe? Gas Mask Tribe is a brand of Dirty Harvard. <coughs> I created this because I wanted to build a community around certain like-minded thinkers. You dig? So, what I ended up doing was coming up with content that resonates with me. Hoping it, it resonates with you. With this lady right here, she is up in age. Let's just say that. Looks good for an age. And she just has something she wanted to give to the ladies. That's what this whole thing is going to be about today. Is the OCD of the women. Right? I call it the obsession. The obsessive compulsive desires. Right? I renamed that. You like that? You like that, huh? Tight. I know. I know. It's the album. Go check out the album. It's the new single called that, too. But, um... It's literally the obsession, compulsive desire of a woman. Her love, that OCD-ness. You get what I mean? So, just give you guys a little rough around the edges. I'm going to show you guys a little something I mean by this. Mains are the easiest animal in the planet. And you want to keep your men very happy. All you got to do is cook a delicious meal. Make love to him anytime he wants. Don't deny the sex because you are hurting yourself and hurting him and sending him over to another place where he doesn't belong. Please your man. Watch a sport with your man. Enjoy his company. Give him the best of you and he is gonna turn you into a queen. They're very simple. Just treat them like kin, and they will return that to you. Don't fight, don't argue. It's all love and peace. Treat them well, and they're gonna do you well. They're very easy. Love your man, queen. If you wanna be a queen, you need to learn how to treat a king. Godly. Look at her. She's just looking good, too. Oh, get on with your bad self, mama jamma. You know what I mean? Hey, some of y'all old, some of y'all young ladies, man, y'all better, man, y'all not getting the picture, man. These, these cougars is coming back stomping. I mean, of course, this particular cougar is married, you know? But she is giving a lot of valid points. Give a nigga some cool cat. You know what I mean? Give a nigga some sucky sucky. You treat me like a king, I have no other choice but to treat you like a queen. You dig? Now, I know, I know. What about all them fuck boys and da 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 do 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 Hey, I could say that about the fuck girls. You get what I mean? There's a story that a woman just got her husband a half a billion dollars. Yep, she's the queen of gold digging. So, if we got some fuck boys, we got some fuck girls out here. So we ain't talking about that, right? Right now we're talking about a genuine woman who's treating a genuine man like royalness. Yep, because he has no other choice but to treat you just like royalty. That's just kind of how it happens, you know what I mean? Giving the ninja some, I mean, li literally, he should be able to have sex whenever he wants to. With you, with you. You know what I mean? Not, don't let me get this, you know what I mean? Some of y'all are like, oh my God, no, he, he can't have sex with anybody. Well, you know, I'm talking about with you. You know, he should be able to. Some of y'all be like, oh no, it's going to mess up this. It's going to mess up that. No, you ain't do this, so I can't give you the coke cat. The coke cat, I mean, the punani. That's what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? See, men love, like this song, it's who we are. You know, we just, mm, yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's why I wrote a song about it. You know, OCD, like her OCD. What this woman just explained to 
to you guys is the actual love of a feminine woman. How much she loves her man. You get that? Look at the happiness on her face. You can't beat that. You know what I mean? There's women right now that's trying to get that. They want that type of love right there. But they're too masculine. There's no masculine bone in her body. Even though she's very, you know, she got a nice fit on her. But there's no masculine. If I was to rate her masculinity on a 1 to 10 personality, it would be a negative 10. You know, I'm not going to rate her masculinity on how she looks. That's wrong. That's pure wrong, right? Because how many women look masculine but, very, but have very feminine traits? So you can't do that. You can't just put it off of physicality that, oh, she's masculine because she has big bone structures or shit like that. Right? All right? I'm, I'm, I'm not talking about the drag queens. I'm not talking about any of those. I'm talking about a woman who just likes staying fit. You did? That's literally it. So I just had to filter off this because this woman is actually telling you guys the actual truth. This is what you call filtering out the BS. You women wonder why your man is going out and doing stuff out with other women and he don't, he's not fucking you. He's not loving you how you're supposed to be wanted. All of this stuff, right? I get it. But what you have to look at is it's not that maybe it's not that maybe he's going out. Maybe you should give up the punani a little bit more often. Your OCD should be literally desires of him. What pleases him? Why? Because he's raised to understand what pleases you. You know, get a job, have the money coming in, be affectionate. Show some emotion, which that's not men, but I mean, hey, women want it. So, you know, you guys got to have Superman. So, okay, whatever. And um, I don't know, there's many other things. Six feet tall, you know, muscular body. Y'all got all these like fucking, you know, ritual traits that you guys look for, the physicality. But if you guys look at that, that goes back on your DNA as a woman. You guys been wanting that from the, you guys are hypergamous. So you've been wanting that from the get-go. You just need to know how to treat it. Like, he needs to know how to treat you. Of course, right? You always got to remember standards, you know? But honestly, give up the panani to your husband or your boyfriend. Really, your husband. You shouldn't be giving up the panani to a boyfriend because he's a boy friend. Get it? He's a boy who's a friend. So that just makes you loosey goosey if you just having sex with your boyfriend. Damn, that's fucked up. I don't mean to say it fucked up like that. If you guys disagree or agree, comment below, like this video. Thank you guys so much. Every time you subscribe, we post another video. Gas Mask Tribe TV podcast where we still talk that bull right here on Biz Entertainment. And y'all go check out the music, Dirty Harvard. Look out for the new single that's coming through. OCD. It's going to be out soon. Chia.